Hello. This video is about using a program called Canagram. This program is a good exercise for students that are learning English in their classes. To open Canagram, we go down to the Start menu in the lower left hand corner. We click once with our left mouse button on Start menu. Then we go up to Education and then we go over and up to Canagram, which is near the top. And then to open Canagram, we open it, we click once with our left mouse button. So this is Canagram. And the concept of Canagram is that we take English words in different categories and we mix up the letters. And the students then have to guess what the word is. So we can see the category listed right here. This is in the upper right hand corner of the blackboard. And as we click that, we go through the different categories. You can see there are many categories that are already included in Canagram. And these are different levels of difficulty. So we're going to start with the easy category. And what we have to do is try to unscramble or unmix the letters to figure out what the word is. So the letters here are L N U sorry, L N U C H. So I believe that that is supposed to be lunch. And so I will type in the word lunch and I will hit enter and it will tell me then if I'm correct. Now if we have a word and we can't figure out what it is, we can click the word hint down in the lower left hand corner of the blackboard. And what this says, it's a young bird especially of the domestic fowl. So I'm guessing that it is the word chicken and it is. So we can always click hint if we need a little bit of help. Now if even if we get the hint and we can't figure it out, we can do reveal word which is down here in the lower right hand corner. So if the students just can't figure it out, they can click reveal word and it will show what the word is. To go on to the next word, we can just click Next Anagram, which is this icon at the very top of this filing cabinet. So it's gone to the next word, and again, I'm not sure what that is, so we'll click Hint. And it says the day before today. Ah, yesterday. And we hit Enter. So if we want to change categories, again, we can just come up here and click another one. So this is uh, computers. And I need a hint on that one. For listening to sound privately. Ah, that sounds like headphones. And this word looks like keyboard. So you can turn this into a competition with your students. You could d divide the class into two separate groups and have them compete against each other in trying to unscramble the words and guess what they are. So this is Canagram. And again, let's review. We click up here to get different categories. We click here to get a hint if we need one and we can click here to reveal the word. And to go to the next canagram, we can just click up here. And we're finished. When we're finished, we can either click the X up here to close canagram, or we can click the bottom drawer of the filing cabinet. 
So that's just a quick lesson on using Canagram. Again, it's a great way for students to practice and learn their English vocabulary. Hope you enjoy using Canagram in your classes, and thank you for listening.